I'm Sir Tap Tap, and welcome back to the aquatic adventure of the last human. I keep wanting to say adventures, so I'm gonna stop myself. So I... I think there are places I can go in the seaweed forest now that I couldn't before. It's so weird. There's like... There's this base of those things that is solid, but none of the rest of it is. It's so weird. Anyway, yep, I knew it. I knew there was some paths we could get... Alright, you gotta switch to it. Oh, you can hear it revved up. Alright, so... What is that? It's some kind of robot! So I guess we're gonna get some sort of turbo boost that lets us force our way through there. Warning lamp advised. Upgrade! Weapon charge speed. Okay, then. This isn't quite unseeable yet, though maybe it's... Wh what are you?! Excuse me, sir! What? Wh what are you? Oh, giant tethered in enemies. Neat. Hey, buddies. Oh, oh, whoa! Sorry. Didn't really mean to murder you, but, uh... I guess that clears a path. Oh, what you got? What you got? Nicholas Terrace, we want to protect you in life. So we got some eco terrorists ah! and some giant sea mine terrorists. Okay. Arg. Save points seem pretty sparse so far, but it's not like there's huge amounts of resistance. Sorry, fishy. I guess the fish are my enemies. I still don't like just sawing everything apart as I move around. Let's try going up this time. So it seems like there's quite a way to go down, so maybe there's just a quick upgrade and we leave up here. Because this should be the ice cap, or no, maybe there's one more level above for the ice cap. What are you doing, Parker? No, no, no! You can't eat things! Parky, there's... what are you doing? That's plastic! Sorry, Parker's being a butthead. What is this? Water purification product is beautiful. Hold on, I can't... Stuff is shooting at me like crazy while I'm trying to read. This is a freaking library, and you will not shoot monstrous death at me. Oh god, it's only temporary. Okay, report streaming in... This is freaking whoa, crazy crab! Calm down, crab. Whoa, whoa, crab. Crab meat, bread, blah, 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 blah. This is dangerous! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, let's just go up here, because there's obviously going to be an upgrade at the end of this tunnel. So there's some sort of Earth report. You know, that is a really good screen. That, if it's still working after all of this, that is a really dang good screen. They got they got their money's worth, honestly. You're fighting for our species, for the good of all life. So we got some eco-terrorists. Blue Earth! I guess that's the eco-terrorist group, and they were trying to save... Earth, but nope. That must have failed. Hey, fish buddy. Sorry. What, Parky? Can't you just calm down for one video? Ow. It's good that health recharges, because some of these hits, you know, not really sensible to be able to avoid. things. Oh! Forest cave state. Is there only one save station per area? I wonder if there's a teleport later that lets us go between stations. Wait! Oh! There's a teleport right now that lets us go between stations. Okay. Forest cave. Crossroads. Got some other crap. Let's... Guess we're heading to Des District 6. Let's take a quick peek at his wood over... But there. Words. What is over this way? Um, hmm. I've got a sneaking suspicion there might be at least one upgrade in this region that we couldn't explore before without the saw. There's an, an unspoken rule of the Metroidvania: is there there can be no dead ends without a power up. I should probably watch my health. Speaking of dead, yeah, there can be no dead ends without a power up. If you design dead ends without a power-up, 
You are very rude. Um, Axiom Verge did this very well. Um, if I recall correctly, there are absolutely no dead ends that aren't either, you know, story-based or, you know, don't end in a thing. A collectible of some sort. But yeah, everything opens, either opens up to an area or, um, actually gives you something. That's just how things should be. So what's... What's this? Hey, you didn't open up? Oh. I guess we need multiple. Who loaded these in enemies with freaking explosives? It seems... Excessive. Hey, ship upgrade! What is this? Engine! This is a passive upgrade. Travel faster! Older model, it's faster. Okay. Good enough for me. Can we swim against currents? We can swim against that current at least. I think there are faster ones. What is this? Oh no! Uh, we lose a little bit of control, but we can go against currents now. That seems important. Alright, let's go to that District 6. Hey, big fishy. Keep in mind that this is like a gigantic submarine, like spaceship submarine. So these fish are like a billion feet tall, or like 200, but still a lot. Does it autosave on each upgrade? I, I haven't noticed. I, I'll, I'll keep an eye out for that. They definitely save points after each boss, which is nice. I'm not a big fan of losing progress in Metroidvanias. Um, I like how Axiom Verge handles it. Can I swim against- yes! I can swim against all of the currents! That seems like a very important upgrade then. Um, do we go this way? Not sure. Oh, I would have remembered you, friends. Oops. Um, I would have- I would have remembered those little buddies. Little cuttlefish looking things. Is this boss- is this boss zone? It's boss zone! The Tranquil! Ancient Peacekeeper! Hi, friend. You're tranquil, aren't you? Can I just- can I just hug you? Are you- are, is this- is this hugs? Are you sending friendly hugs towards me? Friend hugs? Hugs? Those don't sound like friend hug noises you're making, friend. I'm sorry, I have to shoot lasers and try. Oh god! That was not a friend hug. Okay, good. It sends us right. All oh, right. The the worm did that too. Or all of the bosses actually. I think I've died to every boss. Yes, I, I I'm pretty sure I have actually. Oh god. Friend hugs hurt a lot. Dang. These friend hugs have very long range. Do I just have to take out the tentacles first? Is that is that what we got to do here? <laughs> the tranquil. I feel kind of bad just killing giant, really cool sea creatures, and I just have to, you know, kill them. If I... Okay, going that way. Okay, we, we, we gotta destroy the tentacles, I guess. Unless they respawn. This is... If they respawn, that would be really rude. Unless I can... No, I don't... I don't think that saw is a good idea here. Holy crap, you hurt a lot, buddy. Okay, I don't think those bits are dead quite yet. Let's just keep- ow! Just keep hammering on them? Are they- nope, they're not passive. I don't get it. This seems slow and unpleasant. I must be missing something. Is there anything down here? Hmm. I'm not really sure I'm enjoying the concept of this boss. 
I want to just rush in there and pop out that eye of his, but, uh... I just get, you know, locked in by one of these giant tentacles and die. And I wouldn't think it would let me fight a boss I couldn't win against. Oh god. Can I just snipe one in there? Oh god, oh god, okay. Wait, what? How do... Okay, okay. No, 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 honey. No. Don't. I don't think so. I don't think so, Mr. Peaceful. Tranquil. Whatever. I don't think so. Oh, God. Oh, God. I have been missed. Bip! to this one, or... Can I... pop open? Can I damage the mouthy bits? Let's see what the saw does. If the saw doesn't do it, I'm just gonna get some more... see if there's some upgrades I missed or something that, you know, make this make more sense. No? Can I, can I wound it, then saw? Ah! Okay. All is understood. Oh god. Sorry. Oh, don't make it cry out like that. I have more compassion for this octopus than I do for most human enemies. I mean, human enemies, they know what they're doing. But this guy, he's just, he's the peaceful protector or whatever. He's the tranquil. Yes! Okay. Whew. Sorry, Mr. Tranquil. Perhaps in another life we could have been friends. Oh, goodness. But not this one. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. What? Ah, That saw thing is pretty annoying. Okay. Hmm. Okay. I think I have the I think I have a better idea now. Okay. That's how you do it. Sorry, Tranquil. You don't deserve this, but, uh... Sometimes a man's gotta do... What a man has to do. Which is kill the giant octopus. Because of reasons. I'm sorry. Oh, oh no! What are you doing? No, calm down. This is because I tried to kill you, isn't it? Cut that out, please. If you could just, you, you if you could just, j j Ugh. I do like that you can survive at least a couple shots, but uh... okay, a little slightest bit more manageable. <sighs> this is when you can't. Okay, 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 no, no! <sighs> Poor buddy. 
sorry. These are just too... Sorry. Calm down. It'll be over soon. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, he just left! Well, at least we didn't kill him, I guess. He just kinda said, screw this. We got a shield! Protects hull from damage. District 7 Science Facility. Hmm. So this only is to protect from certain things, or... <laughs> That's weird. This... This boss gave us a thing, but the first boss... I think it did. Just sort of gave us a way out. What you got? Fighting for that. Huh. A little dramatic. Eh, excuse me? No! to abuse either. <laughs> nope. So there must be some upgrade that's gating us from that. It seemed to be on a decent pace. It's three bosses down already. Oh, hey! Dikoto Neba Labriat Nelbaba. It's like a... It's like one of those war memorial things. Little building in the background. Giant manta ray! Hi, friend. I don't like the eyes on those fish, though. Those are those are creepy fishes. Life isn't like it used to be. We are all trapped and stuck here. District five. Let's see the government. I wanted to heal the planet. These freaking avalanche guys over here. Lamp advised. I can see well enough, especially with these friends. Oh, this is just like a straight... Can we see? We got about half of our... Oh, we've got 5 out of 26 upgrades? That's nice to see. This flicker... I know what you're going for with the flicker. I think it's a little too much. The seabed. Yeah, I figured this would be dark. Is that a cactus? I don't think those grow underwater. Uh, those are definitely cacti. That's a foot. I'm definitely sure feet don't grow underwater. That's besides the point. Hmm. Yeah, is there? There doesn't seem to be a map until we... Um, tomorrow's future isn't in District 6, but in District 7. Mining jobs in the building. We shall find all the silicon there is under our feet. So they're just talking about mining and stuff for the future. Look at this saw! That's pretty cool. The Abyss. Okay, so there's a lamp somewhere. And I assume at some point it will be required to continue going in the Abyss. There's an interesting mix of obviously earth, you know, surface design, like plant, uh, environment stuff, and uh, actual sea stuff. Evacuation mining tunnels. This is one of the. Whoa! whoa! I guess this is one of the first places to be flooded. It's very bright for an abyss, thanks to these little... Oh, abyss stave station. So let's see what our, our thingy looks like. H. So, oh. Well, let's continue on. No, we don't need to... Ow. It's a tree with like a magic pendant hanging from it, but I guess we can't get it. Ouch. Why must you do this to me? Wait, I, I forgot I have a shield. I haven't noticed how the shield works exactly. I, I don't really want to find out by hitting those rocks though. Hmm. There's gaps in the map, but I guess those just indicate the uh, places where the rocks fall out. 
I definitely feel an oncoming boss fight. I'm not sure if you're all feeling that too, but uh, oh. Never mind. Oh! It's a f glowing sperm. Oh, goodness. I should have known it was an, it would be an anglerfish. False light. That is an awesome name for an evil anglerfish. False light. Look at that. He's eating all the little fish friends. I don't feel bad about killing this guy. Anglerfish are really cool, but this guy's, you know, he's a jerk. He's, oh god. I love that. That is so cool. He, look at his face! That's so good. I'm liking this even more than I thought I would. This is, whoa. Oh, and the, the blinding, he's, he's a, like a living flashbang. This is a really cool boss, and I won't feel bad about killing it. The tranquil, that was, that was rude. You, ugh. how could I enjoy killing the tranquil? But he didn't die, so it's, it's fine, I guess. I mean, I tore off, what, six of his limbs? But I mean, they'll grow back. Probably. He's an octopus. The, the, those, that's the thing octopi do. I also shot his eye up and his mouth, but I mean, he's, he's fine. That's my head cannon. It's not wrong, it's just my head cannon. Wait, did he heal? Does he heal when he eats things? That makes sense. So I take it we're gonna get the lamp from this guy? I would be surprised and possibly even a little disappointed if we didn't. Though lamp doesn't sound super exciting, but maybe I'm wrong. Maybe there's some amazing thing the lamp does. Yeah, he heals a little bit when he chomps. But we can easily out-damage him. Not a bad fight. I mean, presentation-wise, it's really cool, but... It pretty much just has this single loop of, huh? Okay, I guess he changed up the loop a little bit, but still not very different. It's still not super difficult. Easiest boss so far by a lot, actually. Ship upgrade. False light. That is, that is a fantastic name. Is that just a lamp? Yeah, it's the lamp. Light up dark areas. Illuminate everything. Okay. So, darkness isn't ever really... Oh, hello. A big deal. That's really cool. I, did, yeah, I don't think I want to touch that, though. Um... So it really is like the seafloor abyss with like, you know, steam vents and uh, underwater volcano stuff. I'm not sure if falling lava rocks are real, but uh, whatever. It's close enough. So maybe there was some other place that actually was... Oops, those still hurt. Um, actually was unnavigable without the lamp. But thanks to the glowy jellyfish friends wasn't really that hard to see. With no map, I can't really tell if there's stuff I could have... I don't think there's too much over to the, the in in the abyss stuff that I could have missed. Not with what I currently have. Oh! Osiris shutting down major nuclear factories. Uh, nuclear factories. You know, nuclear gets a lot of hate. Um... Global warming, nuclear is not going to contribute to global warming. Quite the opposite. Um, hollow tape. I don't want to get too political, but um, basically means less damage. Less, less. Yeah, it's very telling when whenever scientists approve of something more off more than the general public, it tends to be a sign that the general public not so you know well informed. And scientists generally are in favor of nuclear power. Um, it's far more practical than, well, most forms of power. And definitely way better than pretty much any fossil fuel. The only fossil fuel that has pretty much anything on it is gasoline because of the portability. And gasoline and oil in general obviously has minor back drawbacks. I guess I should call it quits on a video. Uh, we'll 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 finish this one little area. Um, I should have ended it when I got to that when I did the fast travel. But oh, oh, let's just take a peek down here. We'll take a peek. What what is this place? 
It's all these tubes and stuff. I guess we're in, like, some sort of industrial tubey place. You know the types of places with the giant tubes that are, like, a thousand. Oh! Thrash Central. Ugh! Oh, One-way trip! Alright, but yeah, tune in next time for the Central, I guess.